What's up my fellow dudes and dudettes, my light shit army. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to do Today I can't speak. Today we're going to be doing another reaction video to a band named BTS. We're going to be watching War Hormone. Now I do know BTS. Big fan. Let me tell y'all. I'm from uh, I'm from Mississippi, which is a southern state. I'm from a town that doesn't like um, certain music like this. They they're in their own culture. So when I first heard about a K-pop band, first off I'm like it's another language. I didn't want to listen to it. And then I listened to it, and you can feel these people's spirit, their souls, and their music. So we're going to start off with a series of BTS videos, but today we're going to start off with War of Hormone because it was the first one that I could think of that I want to see the music video to. So with that being said, very simple. Before the video starts, hit that like button. Check out the links below, and let's jump into the video, dudes and dudettes. <sighs> Take a second before the video begins and please check out my sponsor, Gamer Grind Co. For the best, fine, and high quality, delicious tasting coffee for gamers. Forget G Fuel, forget all them sugary drinks. Let's go back to straight caffeine, folks. The amazing kind, the good kind, the high quality kind. If you'd like 10% off, please use my referral link down in the description. Now let's continue on to the video. Okay, so here we are. We're going to watch the video for War of Hormones because I already told you that. And just so y'all know, they are signed by Big Hit Labels. Big Hit, Big Hit Studios? Hold on. Let me see. Big Hit Studios, right? Yeah, Big Hit is their label. Uh, it is Korean based. And obviously, they're from the, the company is based out of Seoul. Seoul, S E O U L, I do believe. And we're going to watch War of Hormone. And if you're new to this band, please check them out. Please give them a subscribe. Subscription. Big Hit Entertainment. Yeah. Hold on, what, what was that? How old is this? How old is this, huh? SBS MTV 2014. Guys, I've been around that long. What is that? Am I saying that right? It is. Okay, this is my boy right here, guys. This is my boy. Arium, the rap monster. The, he actually the leader of the group IQ of an amazing percentage oh. okay so now we got Jungkook here uh, who is arguably the simp <laughs> of the group creepy laugh all that off and there's J-Hope which is another simp these three have got to be the most simpiest ones but that's that's unfair because one of my favorite ones is Jin and he because he gets the least amount of lines so everybody always likes the guy that gets the least right so Mm. Okay. Okay, so now we got Jimin, one of the lead vocalists and dancer, as well as V. And then we got Suga just jumped in and Jin. So let's just, that's the introductions. We'll do a video on their intros later, but here we go. Okay, let's go back. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at all their different reactions. It's over one girl. Over one girl. Look. Look <laughs> Okay, so so Suga looks destroyed. Like, oh god, another woman. The guys are freaking simping. And he, V looks like he wanna tear it up. RM's like like, oh man, I know all y'all saw that. He looks like he's never seen a woman in his entire existence. Same thing for him, and he looks like he got he done asked her out and she's done said no. Ho ho, their clothes are all see through. Ho 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 Okay, so first he said, Thank you for existing. Call me, I'll buy dinner. I feel like I'm crazy, crazy, cough, cough. The girls that make me cough, their clothes are all see-through. Thank you. Get back my eyesight. He said, give me my eyesight back. Meaning you stole his, you've caught his eye. You're not, you need to give it back. I'll be in panic. I'll be a fan. 
and I'll be a man of you, you babe. Okay, so so he's saying, I'll be a man for you. I'll be your fan, your man. I'll be whatever you want me to be, but just let me be yours. Okay, so Jung Cook, which is usually a singer, I guess in the older times he was actually a lot more a rapper too, as well as it seems, because usually he doesn't rap. That's usually Suga, J Hope, and RM's position. Um, but so he's eighteen right here, also as he says, and he said, "Please, please keep wearing them high heels, baby. Keep wearing them. Wear the high heels." <laughs> Bad boys, I like a bad girl. Okay, shit just got real. Look at it. He come up and he's like, I'm a bad boy. I like bad girls. And V goes, <sighs> you know, like, it's time to it's time to hit those crazy dance moves. Let's just see that one more time. Let's just go back a little bit. Oh. Okay, I like the transitions, but I want to point out one thing. Why does Junk Cook look like Freddy Krueger sweaters on him? Everybody in this video, like uh, compared to the videos and images that I've seen on the internet, this has got to be older, but it looks more Backstreet Boyish style, you know, all about a girl. I mean, I imagine that's what most of their music is as a boy band. But they wear some really robust clothing. You know, I mean, look at the colorful, like, and they're all different. Because you got uh, RM over here. He's obviously that bad boy, that Al Pacino type. But Suga is kind of a mixture of that and whatever this is. V is the bad boy slick type. This is Freddy Krueger. <laughs> Jimin is just like, he's literally a hipster. And then you got uh, J-Hope back there doing his own thing and... and Jin just don't really have a style, I figured out. He's kind of like the extra guy, but he's not an extra. He's he's just as important to this band as everybody else. Nobody in this band is more unimportant than the other one because none of them are unimportant. But Jin can wear whatever he wants because he's his own man. Let him do his own thing and step off, boy. Let's go back. You are great back and front. You are great head to toe. Okay. Oh, the hip movement. Did this slap your asses? <laughs> hey! Hey! Your boy's ass on fire! Fire! Look about to do the, he about to do the spin rooney that Booker T do in WWF and E. That's so good. Mm. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're that back, okay? And research you, your existence is foul play. If the standard of beauty is C, you are the deep C itself. Man, they got this like poetry in their in their rhymes. You need, you need a beauty cultural asset that needs to be taken care of on a national level. J Ho. Man, she hates my boy just got rejected. My boy just got rejected. Look, that's just a face of a man who was giving his all, his heart and spirit to somebody. He was like, baby, look, I love you. Uh, women are cold iceberg? Let it go. What? Women are cold light? Iceberg? Iceberg? Let it go. Women are lettuce? Iceberg, let us go. Let it go. Uh, is this like a double entendre? Women are cold iceberg. Lettuce 
let it, let it, let it, let it go, let it go, Frozen, the song Frozen, let it go, but let us, maybe I'm reaching too far, but that's, if that's true, that's, that's, that's a dope, that's a dope bar. <laughs> I have a war of hormone and then burst my pimple. It's not a very attractive statement to make if you're trying to pick up the girl. <laughs> What's up, baby? Pop. Yeah, these are for you. Mm, yummy hormones. I have to say, the hook, the chorus, is much catchier than their rhymes in this song, which is very shocking to me. I want to get close to you, but you were too beautiful. So what, she just radiates you away? Like she's just a supernova of beauty and you're just terrified because you don't think you're good enough? Well, you better go over and get that girl. Get that girl. Get that girl. Oh, he looking thug, man. I need to learn this dance. Oh, it's walked on me. I just got to point out here, <laughs> Orium's hair has went completely wild in this video. Huh? Oh, it's about to drop hard, ain't it? Hold on, whose vocal is that? Who is the one, uh, you know, barreling out? I don't see anybody's mouth moving, so who is it? Jimin? It's gotta be Jimin, right? Is it Jimin? I... Y'all came here to listen to them sing. Oh. oh, so so Jimin's ass wasn't good enough for you this time? You had to just leave Jimin hanging. You said, you know what? <laughs> Jungkook got that ass, boy. He just clapping all his friends' asses, and once again, he is surprised here. Look, he is surprised. Because apparently Jimin's ass isn't as hot as Jungkook's ass. I don't know. Maybe his ass is... Oh, yeah. That was an awesome... V gets the girl? Wow, that's, that's pretty freaking cool. That's pretty freaking cool. Well, my fellow dude, it's that was my reaction to War of Hormone by BTS, and uh, I, I'm impressed. I'm impressed because you don't see bands with choreography. There's singers, there's rappers, there's dancers. Yeah, there's there's uh, and there's groups out there that can dance like this, but K-pop has a very special ideal and sense that they can do everything in one package. You want the dancing? You got it. You want the singing? You got it. You want the rap? You got it. You want the emotion? You got it. You want the poetry in the lines? You got it. You want the good hooks? You got it. You want different personalities and all of them stand out on the screen even though there's seven of them? You got it. It's not too much to ask for. War of Hormone uh, is definitely, it's, it said it was 2014, so it's very different from like the few songs that I've heard of them nowadays. So I expect better things from them. Like I'm not saying this is a bad video by any means, but you can definitely tell that they were really... New kids on the block, vibe-ish. Not, not exactly. What about like kind of like the scheme, uh, the outfits? It just didn't seem BTS y to me. Then again, maybe I don't know too much of the new BTS because I'm only a relatively new uh, stan of the BTS. I'm a BTS army. <laughs> But with that being said, my fellow dudes and dudettes, if you want to see more videos, if you have somebody you'd like to see me check out and see me react to, please drop a comment down below or right down there. 
and let me know who you'd like to see me react to and maybe I'll react to it depending on how many uh, depending on like right now I'd say it depends on if there's at least more than two people that want me to see a specific thing then I will definitely look it up as long as it is an interrogatory don't try to take advantage of me now but until the next video my fellow dudes to do this this has been Lash Say RH and hope you enjoyed the video because if you did you need to hit the red subscribe button hit that like button check out the social media handles down below until the next video my fellow dudes and do this this has been Lash Say RH and we're now going to be signing off peace out my dudes and do this.